All right, so we have an appointment, Miss Downey. <laughs> Helping Hearts for Hadley Schools. I just have um, a the race room because last year I got to so I'm sure I remember. <laughs> so we have not just Miss Downey, but we also have <clears throat> Miss Mashensky. Actually, and Stacy will be speaking. <laughs> thank you. So thank you for giving us the time. Yes. <laughs> thank you. Um, so just to recap on last year, uh, we had our second race. We were able to provide the schools with $15,000 this year. So for a total of two races, we've given $30,000 back to the schools. Um, they've been able to purchase things like iPads for the first grade, uh, tons of software, smart boards, digital camera scanners. And actually this year we gave the PE department of both schools $500 each to spend however they wanted to. Um, the high school bought archery equipment and the elementary school bought Fitbits, which are those bands to <laughs> monitor your, your exercise. Um, so, the, and there's musical equipment that's been bought as well and art supplies and the list goes on and on. So with $30,000, that's pretty good. Um, we, are hopeful that you guys will support us again. Uh, the race this year will be on April 12th instead of the first weekend of April because Easter falls on that Sunday. So it's going to be on the 12th. Um, we, the couple things that we need from approval from you guys is to hang our banner that we hang every year on the Route 9 fence. Uh, I'd like to do that at the end of this month, starting at the end of this month because our registration opens. Um, and that way we get more people to sign up earlier mm -hmm. <laughs> than later. Uh, also, we you guys allowed us to do the apples in the street, so we'd just like to touch those up again. Um, yeah, you got the patterns there, I think so you're just going to uh, trace them out again. Yeah. I think that was really helpful. Yeah. It was, yeah. yeah they, they had, like, we had such a response from that. Just people <clears> were like, this is so cool. <laughs> so it was a neat added addition to the race. Um, and then also people actually you know, people would drive by and they're like, what are those apples about? You know, and so we got, we got phone calls about that too. So that was really That's cool. That's good. <laughs> um, I spoke to uh, Chief Spank Mabel today and he said he's all on board again for assisting with whatever we needed. It worked out really well last year. Um, Roxanne talked to... I talked to um, Chief Stanley and he said that he's on board, but it's all going to depend on the new chief that steps in. So we're aware of that and we'll speak And I'm on. sure he'll be on board also. <laughs> I mean, hopefully they will be, you know, it's for the community, it's for the schools. We can make actually sure had that. help last year painting the apples too. We did yes. it during the day um, when there was less traffic and on the busy roads that we painted, we waited until there was an officer available to help us out. Just with facilitating traffic. What do you, what is else? it going to be at the same? Is it the same time? Is it Sunday same morning? Time. Yep, Sunday same morning. Yep. Yeah. Sunday morning on the twelfth, ten o'clock. Um, it seems to be the least busy time for traffic, wise, honestly, because of um, the people are either sleeping or <laughs> in church or, <laughs> or you know, it's just it. It works. It happy. works. Yeah. yeah. The time yeah. works. It just it seems like it's the less. Um, and then uh, the last thing I have is that I spoke to the IRS today, and we have been approved for a 501c3 number, so we will be officially a nonprofit organization. So oh, we're really excited about that. So all the donations that we received in the past will now be tax deductible. They'll, they'll be retroactive to when we started, and then anything that we receive from now on will also be 100% tax deductible. So. That was huge. <laughs> so. Does the school get more money now because of it? <laughs> no. Hopefully, you know, you know it well. just it opens up more, you know, options for us to have donations, you know, be larger amounts as right. well as I can then go after grants, um, specific technology items, things like that. So, um, so in the scheme of things, it does. All right. Let the schools have more money. <laughs> okay. So. Um, Any other questions? No, certainly have our full support on it. <laughs> it is a kind of fun event to watch everybody do it. It is. It is. It's, it's growing, you know, it's just... Really it was, I mean, just in the second year last year, and I think it was for the people that actually did it and competed to have, you know, the time stamp for, for each person. I mean, that 
it, it's come a long ways in two years. And I mean, the amount of money you've raised for the school is, is tremendous. And the only thing I would like to say is I would like to make sure we get all this information to Richard so that we can run that mm -hmm. on public access so sure. that even more people find out what we're doing and when it is. Help. I think awesome. you know, that's, you. that's another thing we can do. But as, yeah. as far as support for hanging the banner and putting the apples on the street, um, I'll make a motion that the select board is fully behind uh, the Helping Hearts. Yeah, I'll second. May I so, subject to any order of conditions by public obviously, safety and public Obviously. Right. Right. We don't want to step up. <laughs> and we approve closing the roads for the race on yes. mm -hmm. April Whatever. 12th. April 12th at 10 a.m. All right. So, and there was a second to that motion? Yes. All in favor? Aye. 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 Thank you very much. Thank you. Have a good night. Thank you.